Hi everyone! Happy Easter! And welcome back to my vlog. I had a super fun week this week. First off, every morning that I woke up, the elf had done something fun. It was so exciting each morning, getting up and wondering what he had done that night. Hey everyone! Look what I found! The elf! He's with the balloon animals that I made in my last vlog. <laughs> he likes the horse one by the looks of it. <laughs> Silly elf. Oh, he left a note. It's really hot in my bunny suit, so I think I need a way to cool down. By the way, remember to f my friend Steven? I found him today, so we're hanging out. Look, we found them. They're in the fish aquarium. <laughs> Look at it. Oh, I bet that's a good way to cool down for sure. Hey, Steven. Oh, and look at this morning. They're watching a movie together. I wonder what it is. It's the Super Mario Brothers show. Oh, so much fun. The elf set up his own toy town. I can't wait to play with him in it. Look at all the fun. It's the cutest little town ever. Ooh, even a Lego house. On this day, I woke up to Steven and the elf playing this cute little Easter game. And what you do is you push them down and then you get your net and you gotta wait. And eventually they'll spring up and you gotta try to catch them in your basket. Is he gonna pop? Oh, there he goes! Oh, I missed! So much fun, though. He was such a silly elf. And I love him so much. I hope he comes back again soon. This week, we also went to see the new Mario Brothers movie. It was so good. I loved it so much. I want to go see it again if I can. <laughs> oh, I couldn't even choose a favorite part because there was so much fun stuff in it. Did any of you get to see it? What was your favorite part? This week we also did a scavenger hunt. It was really neat. We had to drive all over the nearby town and find different things. Our first clue is, what is the animal on the patio of the tea bar? Oh look, it's a bunny. It looks like he has some eggs. What colors are on the sign in the center de la Val de Moor? I see red, blue, and yellow. On the electronic screen near the fire station in St. Arthur, how many ducklings can you see? Oh look, one, two, three, four, four ducklings. Make your way to the Glencoe Community Center and write down the color of the duckling's hat. Oh, I think it's blue or purple. How many eggs are in the window of Tidehead Fire Hall? I see one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. How many flags are in front of the new offices of the Community Vitality and Tourism Center Department in Asselville? One, two, three, four. At the Camelton City Hall, there's a picture in the door of the main entrance. Who is it? We're gonna have to look that one up for sure when we get home. The next one is, at the golf club, what special anniversary are they celebrating this year? Oh, they opened in 1923. That means it's been a hundred years. Well, we found out the, the picture of the person was of the mayor of Camelton. And there was also some little fun riddles to solve and some letter scrambles. Would you like to see my favorite Easter decoration? It's right here. It's Mama Hen. Isn't she the cutest? I love her so much. My brother and sister actually have another video on our channel where they did a challenge and toy review with her. <laughs> I love it so much. They might do some more videos like that. And this summer, I might get to see some real hens. When I visit my grandparents, They've got some chickens. I can't wait. Also this week, we went to the mall and got to meet the Easter Bunny and one of his chicky friends. They gave me this chocolate bunny. 
It's so yummy. And there was also face painting. My brother chose Luigi and my sister Hello Kitty. <laughs> Aren't they so cute? And there was also cotton candy. Mmm, yummy. And then it was Easter morning. And we woke up and there was gifts at the table waiting. I was so excited. But I saved mine to open with you all. We'll open it in a moment. I'll tell you what else happened first though. There was a note from the Easter Bunny explaining about the egg hunt and telling us that Elf decided to go back with him towards the North Pole and he'd be back again someday to visit us. We then did the Easter egg hunt. <laughs> it was fun searching for all the different eggs. And then we had some meals with family. It was such a nice day. Oh, we also blew bubbles outside and played with our new things. But I think it's time to open that kinder. I can't wait any longer. Okay, let's open it up and see what's inside. Oh, what pretty paper on it. Oh, let's see. Oh, wow. Look at that giant egg. Look at that. So smooth. Mmm, it smells so yummy. Let's see what happens when we try to open it. Oh! Whoa! Look at that. It's chocolate on one side and white chocolate on the other. It's super yummy. And look at this big toy. There we go. I'm going to set my chocolate aside so I can munch on that later. Let's open it up and see what's inside. Oh my goodness! I think it's gonna be super cute. Ooh. So, this shows the different ones you can get by the looks of it, because I see yellow. I think we've got this one right here. And it's instructions how to put it together. And you can play with it on your phone also. Oh, and this is like a little card that you can keep to help you play it on your phone. And then there's the warning signs. So let's take a look at these instructions and see if we can put it together. Body. There we go. It's almost lined up. Perfect. Then this white part. Oh, it's its mane, its tail. Then we'll put this part. Oh, it's so nice. Look at it. 
How cute is that? And then we can make it even more special by adding on wings. And it's helmet part. Whoa. How awesome is that? What an awesome toy. Well, everyone, thank you so much for watching this vlog. And I hope to see you in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss it. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And remember, in the words of Arnold H. Glasslow, the key to everything is patience. You get the chicken by hatching the egg, not from smashing it. So in other words, don't get frustrated. Take your time, and you never know what's going to come out. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Can't wait to see you in the next one.